Welcome to this week's Intuition Insight for week of the 11th of December 2023. For those of you in the Northern Hemisphere like me, I hope you're keeping warm in this wintry weather. And this week's Intuition Insight is from my own oracle, Reclaim Your Intuition. And it's a really, really nice piece of guidance for this time of year when we are, for those of us who are in the sulfur winter. It's about belief and specifically intellectual belief. So the barometer here kind of has a scale of belief at the bottom. There's victim, belief and mentality. There's intellectual belief. Then we get to maybe, then we get to soul belief. But we're dealing with intellectual belief here. So let's focus in on that because the intellectual belief is about the things we hold in our conscious mind that we believe to be true. Because the conscious mind differentiates between truth and lie, good and bad, right and wrong, left and right. A soul belief doesn't have that level of judgment and discernment. It just accepts what is. Um, with soulful living, you just flow through what happens and deal with things as it happens. But our intellectual beliefs put a different shadow and cast over the life that we live. And it takes us away from that soulful living. So the question to ask yourself this week is, what intellectual beliefs are you holding on to that actually may no longer be true for you. They may no longer be helping you or serving you. And there may be lots of things coming up from people who, who celebrate Christmas or who have any festivities now towards the end of the year, that family tensions can get, can get heightened, relationships and the emotions within them can become more sensitive. So what beliefs do you have about yourself and about other people that you can let go of now? Because in families and relationships, there's, you know, someone who, this you know, you talk about people, oh, well, that's just how they are. This is what they're like. Well, are they really like that? Or have you just decided they're like that based on one incident? Because one incident is not a pattern. So what beliefs do you have about other people that it's just time to let go of? Just to release them. And there is a full moon coming up on the 27th. The new moon is next Tuesday, actually the 12th. So, so the new moon next week um, with this question, what is it you need to release and let go of? It's time to go within. And then as the moon brightens, it becomes more visible to the full moon on the 27th. Then it's time to release them. So you're not necessarily releasing everything and letting go of everything next week. Because it's not always that easy, is it? It's just not that easy. The conscious mind does not like to let go of what it believes to be right. But it's time to go within and spend some time with your soul and start to question the intellectual beliefs that you have about the people around you, about the situations and circumstances you find yourself in. What are the things that you've believed all of your life that you can let go of? As we move from childhood to adulthood, we let go of believing in Santa. I hope that's not a spoiler for anyone. We let go of believing in the Easter Bunny. We let go of believing these things that were taught as children and as adults. We accept and understand and know intellectually those things can't be true. But there are lots of things like that in your life. Spend the next few weeks with this message. The intuition insight is normally for the week ahead, but I think this extends out a little bit more. And if you want to, spend some time making some notes in a journal or however you choose to make notes to yourself about what no longer serves you that you believe? And actually, what beliefs? What beliefs are you just tired of? It might be beliefs that other people have around you. That's their beliefs, not yours. Let go of it. So this is the time for looking at your intellectual beliefs, the things that are in your head that no longer serve you, the things that puzzle you, and working up to the new moon on the 27th of December to let them go. Wishing you a wonderful week. Take care. Bye.